that what actually happened. You promised me the goods would be in my warehouse four days ago. And that was the reason why I gave you all the money you needed. So I don't understand the grammar you're talking about. Just get my containers out of the wharf. Ten containers seized? No, this guy must be joking. Hello? Yes, it's me, Ugochugu. I am coming over to your house right away. In the next 10 minutes, I'll be there. No, no, when I come, when I come. It's very serious, very serious. savings gone. All the things I've toyed for. Look, I have always taken you as my godfather. I believe if you pull a few strings, this thing will be resolved. It's okay. I, I want you to relax. Hmm? Now let me get you your favorite drink, the brandy. I'm in trouble and you're talking about brandy. <laughs> has ordered the seizure of my containers. I know, but who are the federal government? Men with power. And because they have the power, they have the capacity to dictate to you whose containers are to be seized and whose containers are not to be seized. Think. Chief, please. I know very well you have top government officials and friends, and I know one or two of your relations who are connected. Use them to get my containers released. That's what I ask. Okay, that's all right. No problem. I am going to call one of my very good friends, the Comptroller of Customs, and ask him to have your containers released. But, you'll have to do it yourself next time. Thank you. I was going to ask you, don't you have any organization or any brotherhood in case of such incident? I don't understand. Good. My ability to help you solve your problem is not because of one top government official or a kinsman, but because I belong to a family of prominent, eminent citizens of this country. So all we do is to come together, to jubilate, jive it, but 
with the sole aim of helping one another. And that is why we are called a family. So, which uh, family are you talking about? I am talking about the Royal Oman family. No, Chief. I made my money through hard work and not through rituals. Why should I join your family? I made you go to school. And it was through me that you made all your money. And while you were making your money, all through the years you made your money, I have never ever allowed you to go into rituals. So why should I ask you to be involved in such a barbaric act? What I ask of you is for you to protect yourself, your family and your business. That's all. And just in case you don't know, very soon, pretty soon, people will come after you. You've got to wake up. This is no rituals. Think and be wise. Chief, it sounds uh, contradictory to my Christian teachings. I am a knight and a strong follower of the Christian faith. But I believe in giving to Caesar that which belongs to Caesar. The choice is yours. I am going to miss your food. Really? Yeah, but I can't help it. You know, I don't leave life without. So, how long are you going to spend on this trip? Maybe three days. Three days? Well, Daddy, you promised to take us to your home back. Yes, I promised, but Daddy can't do it this time around. Some other time, maybe. You will still understand. But, Daddy. I know what you're trying to say. Hmm? Okay. I'll get you something when I'm coming back. Hmm? It's a promise. Yes, it's a promise. Will you be a good boy? Hmm? Yes, sir. You'll be a good girl, right? Good boy, hmm? From our book, 
of ethics it is written that the brotherhood will only be extended to the people who believe and subject themselves to our deity who protects us like sons we are. We shall cast our vote to adopt or reject the proposal of extending this brotherhood to an outsider. And this must be won by a simple majority. Shall we cast our vote?
write your name with your own blood. successfully join the brotherhood. What is it you seek? I want to secure my wealth. I want absolute power and protection. Is that all you want? That's all I want for now. It shall be done. No, it's clear, sir. Okay. Now, I want you people to finish the surveying and registration in time. The earlier the better. All right? And secondly, the land I purchased at when I want the construction commenced immediately with this one. So tell your boss to arrange with the contractors to expedite action. All right? I want the two buildings to be ready in less than three months. There's no problem, sir. We will get it. Just like we promised. All right. Um, when we get to town now, I'll issue you guys a check for the preliminary work. Okay? this afternoon. Now I heard that say that when death comes knocking on the door of the dog, he does not perceive the smell of excrete again. Now do you have any problem with anyone? You are asking me. You better go and ask on whose farm you are collecting firewood. Go and ask them. Your son, whose only stock in trade is poor one night, thinks that he has made money. But let me warn you and your son for the last time. The day you step into that land is the day you will die. Now, which land are we talking about? Oh, you are asking me. Anyway, I have been warning you, but unfortunately, you may not be alive to hear my warning again. Was it not your brother who sold the land to my son? It is a lie. Sold my land to anybody. I am tired of your insult. I insult you. It's your cap. Insult you. I will tell you that you can't even give an account of what happened to your dead father. Now let me warn you. You dare not touch the tail of the lion, whether dead or alive. Because you are warning me. All right. We shall see. We have seen many things. We shall see.
Obu Watamba Kona Deoto. He who says he's bigger than myself, let him step into this land. Kill him! Kill him! <laughs> I had to cut short my visit to replan. Mazioka for baffled me. He denied selling the land to me. But I was there when the elders counted and gave him the money. <laughs> they are your people. You know them best. But if I should advise you, avoid the man. He even went as far as discrediting my father's name. Saying I should remember the way my father died. And that is very common with the villagers. What do you expect from them? They are envious of your success. They would like to eliminate you. Maybe he must have heard you want to build a house there. I will not spare him. <laughs> now you are talking. The best means of defense is to attack. Are you sure you are the bona fide owner of this land? What kind of question is that? Because I was warned by an elder in my clan, particularly about this land. Um, but you see, this land belongs to my family. It is my inheritance. 
Because yes. I was told it's your late brother's property, which he sold to Ugo Egwon. Shiniki, my land. Sold to who? Ugo Egwon. Hey, look, this land is my family land. I swear by the deity I serve, this land is highly my own. Eh? You don't have any problem at all. You don't have any problem. Eh? Due to the things I've heard, I'm, I'm no more interested. You are no longer interested, eh? Good afternoon. Yeah. So how's your family? I'm not bad. Please, is your husband at home? Yes, he is. Come in. No, please. Can you call him for me? I'm in a little bit of age. I hope there's no problem. No, no problem at all. I just want to see him. Fred. 
but you good. Why did you refuse to come in? Nothing. It's just that I'm in a hurry. I want to get back to the office to continue the meeting. Good. Good to good things are hard. Real hard. What about your bank job? The bank business is okay. It's just that I need to leave the position that I am now. Leave the position? How do you mean? I might be sounding ridiculous, but I need your help. What help? I don't need financial help. Maybe you could help me and introduce me to your people. My people? What are you insinuating? Uncle Chuku, you know me before now. I was as rich as you are now. Attacks here and there, and, uh, simply because I did not protect myself. Fred, I can see you have nothing serious to discuss. Would you come your friend? I know. Okay, drop by the office tomorrow, I'll give you some money. I have said that before. That is not what I need. What do you need? I want to be part of your lodge. Am I, am I not qualified? Eh? You have been successfully initiated into the royal family of the Brotherhood. What is it you need? Riches. And what will you pay in return? Dedication and obedience to the family. Is that all you want? And protection, my Lord Spiritual. It is done. Oh, Bernie! Hi, hi, hi. 
Zemaya. Zemaya. Oh, oh, Zemaya. 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 Oh, Zemaya. 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 Oh, oh, Zemaya. 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 Zemaya, 
Zemaya, oh Zemaya, 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 oh oh Zemaya, 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 oh Zemaya. Hi, hi, hi. Tugs the chicks and flies away. But it has never been heard that the mother hen retaliated. An enemy that stretches forth his sword and strikes the son of a warrior only thinks of one thing battle. Spiritual master, tell us who did this to our brother. I saw servants of the fourth level of darkness in alliance with some warriors. The battle line is strong. They have drawn the first blood. Now it is our turn to respond. Who shall go for us? Zemaya. Zemaya. Oh, oh, Zemaya. 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 Oh, Zemaya. Zemaya. But Master, Zemaya. it is not in our power to do battle oh, with people from that ring. Then we cease to be who we are. Who will go for us? Who amongst us here, brothers, will volunteer to redeem the life of our student brother here? Who are the feats amongst us here? Will volunteer to redeem the stolen life of our brother? What is the bone of contention? That is not necessary. It is. Because we do not do battle when the provocation is with one of us. Land dispute, brother. Alarm. A lamb was sold to our brother here with an intent to defraud him. And for justice, he joined our brotherhood. But the enemy, their enemy still reached him. So who amongst of here will go and fight for us? In that case, brother, I shall go. Udemba, that will be dangerous. You remember, we are still I know. And that is why I have volunteered to go. If we keep dreading the fourth estate of darkness, because it is people by witches and witchcraft, then before long, we shall begin to dread the roadside magician. I shall go. And I know I shall return. So shall it be. Go, conquer, and return a hero. Hi, 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 Yeah. I can feel it. 
feel your pretty nice. Well, stranger. Show thyself to your God. Man. Who are thou? And what force brought you there? You are asking questions. The answer to which can be found only in your grave. It is only my enemy that stands before me on top of my death. And to join the rest of them, you are going to join them. You are going to die! You are going to die! Take it! Go, 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 go! I'm with you, man. Go share, go share with you, man. Go share with you. what you are. Let me tell you, you will never succeed, no matter your antics. You are like a monkey on top of a tree, bragging arrogantly before a lion on the ground, and you know what that means. Watch you, what you say, because your words will not only provoke me, but provoke this sword that will strike you down. The sword strike me from who? From you? Yes! <laughs> Impossible. I will have rumor that you belong to society. But even if you join the devil himself, let me tell you, not you, not even 1,000 of your time can stop me, AK, from becoming the chairman of the bank. And I want this to be drawn into your head. AK, 
you are nothing. Nothing but a dead animal on the street waiting for the vulture to devour. You have sounded the drums of war, and when the warriors will be on stage to dance, I hope you'll be there. <laughs> hey, K, are you one of the warriors? Sound your war drums, and I will dance to the tune. You will be crushed, I can assure you. Good day. You will do nothing. You will do nothing! Nonsense. I must be the chairman of this. Would it like it or not? The situation has changed. Take it. Oh. <laughs> 
consumed by your words. And she, in her own time, will reveal to you the great secret. Do you promise to renew our strength and pay the price of our lives? You may now go and sit down.
What can you offer for your protection? What can you give to get power and wealth? Are you man enough to be with the warriors? Are you brave enough to stand the warriors? Can you be with the warriors? Can you stand the warriors? Think about this, my brother. Oh, 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 oh. Warriors of darkness. They are everywhere now. What's up with you? I don't know. I don't know where he had talking. Before I knew it, he started shaking. Then vomited blood. If I could run upstairs to get the car keys, the boy was already gone. Imagine, my son just left like that. Oh my God, what have I done? What is this? Oh my God. What life will I have? What have I done to my son? I shall expose them all. All of them. They shall suffer what I suffer. All of them. Can you swear no. with your own blood no. to keep their dark secret? Can you give the life of your own son? Remain rich to remain famous. Will you spill the blood of your own wife? Tell me, tell me. Messenger of sadness. Time. Can't sin with the spirit of death. Hi. 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 You. What do you want from me? Stay away from me! Stay away! You are mine is dark against the brotherhood. I am no longer a member of the brotherhood. My relationship was severed with you the night you took away my son. Still, you must pay the price for your protection. I am not paying any price for any protection. And very soon, the whole world will hear about your evil activities. You have vowed to reveal the secrets of the Brotherhood and expose all our activities to the outside world. All these you have vowed to protect and uphold, even it be with the last drop of your blood. I will stop at nothing until I revenge the death of my son. Then you leave me with no option. For your protection, what can you give to get power and wealth? Are you man enough to be with the warriors? Are you brave enough to stand the warriors?
Can you be with the warriors? You know what hear me? Can the warriors? Think about this, my brother. Oh, 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 oh. Warriors of darkness. They are everywhere now. Can you swear with your own blood to keep their dark secret? Can you give the life of your own son? Remain rich.
Angels of the dark, I summon you. Join me as I beseech the Prince of Darkness to possess me. Prince of Darkness, you hold dominion all over the world. Possess me here. In victory. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Tonight is the night. Uh -huh. Yes. I said tonight is the night. Yes. yes. Tell your neighbor that tonight is the night. Tonight, tonight is the night. Tonight, tonight, is, the night. tonight, tonight is, the is the night we are going to do battle with the evil ones. Yes. Amen. We are going to pray right now against every occultic power. Mm -hmm. Every demonic power, every Jesus. spirit from the pit of hell, anywhere they gather, we're going to destroy tonight. We have Man. authority. Begin to pray. Begin to destroy. Begin to destroy. Begin Assignment. Are you feel? Yes, you are a master of the fifth realm. I did all I could. You failed in your entire mission. Now, one of our brother died last night. But if you have carried your out your assignment, he would have still lived. 
Each time I try to organize my faculties and then give them an astral confrontation, the influence of a church nearby always disorganized my concentration. Church? Yes. Did I hear you say church? You mock this family, brother! And you try to tell this family that you failed simply because of a minor, money hungry, one room apartment church that knows nothing rather than have demonically possessed women? Is that what you are trying to tell this family? I don't know how they do it, but that church is a problem to me. What is your oath of allegiance to this family? To engage in spiritual warfare in defense of every member of the brotherhood. To identify all obstacles that constitute some impediment to the progress of the brotherhood and uproot all of them, even if it means to stick in my own blood. Very well said. Now, you have 24 hours to disperse that congregation. Otherwise, you will have to face the consequences. So be it.
talk to. The Holy Spirit is much busier than that. It's occupied with loftier things, you know. I still feel that if you moved your church to a more central place, quite honestly, you'll make more converts within a short space of time. Okay, um, I'll give you 10 million. Perhaps it might help to hasten matters. <laughs> I said, don't bother, sir. Anyway, thanks for your kind gesture. I will call upon you when it is properly needed. Uh, Pastor, are you sure you wouldn't want some time to think about this? I don't think so. It doesn't need your own. Thank you. I see. So let me let me pray with you and then go for one call. No. Zemaya. Zemaya. Jesus. Oh, oh Zemaya. 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 Oh, Zemaya. 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 Oh, oh, Zemaya. Zemaya. Zemaya, oh Zemaya. Hi. Now, see, mm. good day, sir. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, there's something I wanted to do for me. Yes, sir. Please mention it, eh? Whatever I said, I'll do it for you, sir. Right. Good. You have a building that you rented to some church people. Hmm? Yes, sir. Uh, I want you to eject them from them. I want to use that building. And I'm going to give you 10 million for that. I will, sir. I will say, I will do as you have just said, sir. Whatever you say, sir, shall be done, sir. I will come back in the next two weeks. Sorry, sir. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I hope you enjoyed the last sermon that was preached. Yes. So how many of you are, uh, how many of you are for the evangelism? What are you people doing here? Chief. What are you people doing here? Chief. Where's your pastor? Ah, Chief, take it easy now. I said, where is your pastor? Please, he's in there. I hope there's no problem. You people should pack out of this place. Ah, I said, back out of this place! Back out of this place! I said, back out of this place! I said, tell what is it? We will back out of this place! I said, back out of this place! Ah, Chief! Why would you want us to vacate this land after praying with us and placing our stake here? What is going on? <coughs> what is happening to me? You just told us to vacate this land! Ask you to leave? That's what you just said! For what? By the way, who am I? Who would the cook with that girl here with? my 
mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Presentation outside. Presentation outside, Pastor. Father, in the name of Jesus, complete this miracle in the name of Jesus. Complete this healing in the name of Jesus. We pray in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Chief, it's you again. So what can I do for you this time? Pastor, I'm a very patient man. Very tolerant. Don't push your luck. And don't push me. Two captains cannot be in the same ship. And you know that. I don't understand what you are talking about. I will tell you what I am talking about. I will say it once more, and this time with finality. I want you and your church to move from here to whatever location you choose. I will pay for your movement if it becomes necessary. And that's it. The reason is simple. We can no longer coexist in this same environment. No. Elias Dem. It's not a place for the lamb. Neither is a snake's pit a place for a child to play with. And he who plays with fire certainly will get his hands burnt. But I'm sorry, gentlemen. This church, this church will remain as long as the people kingdom Amen. Amen. Your, your church people are already cooperating. Very nice people. And very easy going. Why some of them concentrate on making money? You neither want money or want peace. And because of that, you have violated our sovereignty. And so death shall await you. But I tell you, I tell you all. The Bible tells me in Psalm 37, verse 38 to 39, the wicked shall be destroyed. And the transgressor of the enemy shall be destroyed to get. Oh yes. But the wicked shall be cut off. The salvation of the Lord is of the righteous. Amen. He is my strength in a time of trouble. Now let your Bible also tell you that you bring curse and damnation upon yourself and your church if you fail to move from here. I am the son of the most high God. Amen. Filled with the Holy Ghost. Yes. Therefore, therefore, I, I fear no evil. <laughs> you are the son of the Most High God. You fear no evil. Good. Good. Chelsea. Zemaya. Oh, Zemaya. Zemaya. Wait for us. Zemaya. Zemaya. Oh, Zemaya. Hi. Hi. Hey, hi. 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 No weapon form of passion against me shall ever prosper. When the children of Israelites would live in Egypt, the rest he could not stop them. Why? Because God has a prison on that behalf. Nothing! I said nothing can stop you from getting your job. Today, God will arise in your situation. Amen. No matter your situation, God will arise. Amen. Because the Lord said, we 
will arise. Amen. I will arise.
Father Lord, I lift up this congregation unto you. I dismiss this congregation, O oh God, not unto death, but unto life. I dismiss this congregation, O oh God, not unto sickness, but unto health. I dismiss this congregation, O oh God, not unto poverty, but unto riches. Lord, this week is blessed. Amen. The going in and the coming in, O oh God, is blessed. Amen. Whatever they do, O oh God, this week is blessed. Amen. Their businesses, O oh God, is blessed. Amen. Whatever they lay their hand upon to do this week, O oh God, is blessed. Amen. Lord, let your name be glorified. Amen. I dismiss this congregation unto thy hand. Amen. Take all that glory. Amen. Take all that adoration. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. The grace. The grace of the Lord Jesus Christ. The love of God. And the fellowship of the Holy Spirit. The grace of the Lord Jesus Amen. Surely. In the name of Jesus, Amen. Lord, I come against you for spirits. Yes. You are gothic fires. You are gone spirits. You are good spirits. I bind you in the name of Jesus. Amen. The Bible says, by the visit of the Lord, every yoke is broken. Yes. I destroy you. Amen. I destroy you today. Amen. I destroy you today. Amen. Holy Ghost. Fire. Holy Ghost. Fire. Master, my 
of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. The point I'm making is this. We must move out of this place. In fact, we must run away from this trouble once and for all before something else happens. Never! Where is the faith, pastors? Where is the belief in the knowledge of God's power? Is it not written in this book, in the Bible, that everything will get out good for those who believe in God, for the righteous? You, Pastor Chris, you told us that this people offered five million naira, and with that, we can move into a new site and build the bigger church. Shall we all stay here and continue to suffer under the sword of this mysterious people? Tells us in Psalm 37, verse 20, that the wicked shall perish, and the enemies of the Lord shall be like the fat of the lambs. They shall be consumed into smoke, and they shall be consumed away. Pastor Chris, read the writing on the wall. Exactly. People who of a sudden have gone blind in this church. Oh. Our congregation has scattered. We have nothing on the ground. And yet you are stumbled over the whole thing. We must leave. We must move away from here. Give to Caesar what is Caesar's. And to God what is God's. Isn't that what the Bible says? This land upon which this church is built belongs to those occultic men. And the one they are offering us money for belongs to God. Past Never! Never! the land the Lord has consecrated to the glory of God. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I shall fear no evil. But the Lord is with me. I had always thought you a wise man, Chris. But now, in this house. Okay? Yeah. Drinking and playing draft. Nah, no. We are not going. Our church is on fire. Uh, what are you talking about? <laughs> Our church is fighting with God people. They even brought one coffee like that. Some people saw it and got blind. <laughs> Me, I run away. <laughs> they have even threatened to return again. Me? <laughs> I can't risk my life. Oh, wait, what, what about the quarrel? Which quarrel? I told you our church is fighting war. They asked us to leave the place. Our pastor refused. The court also refused. So we equally refused to toy with our lives. Okay, incredible. Who won that DJ some rumors have been hearing?
in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. After conception comes deliverance. Yes, Lord. At this oh God is the time. Can I help you? Um, I am from Christ Mission Pentecostal Church. I came to see you, sir. Well, there better be something important. Very well, sir. It's all right. Come in. so that we can reach an understanding in such a way that will be favorable to both of us. I see. Are you the founder of your church or the senior apostle, the senior pastor? So I know how to relate to you because I'm a knight. If you are the founder or the senior, then we operate at the same level. Are you? I may not be the founder, Chief, mm. but equal with the senior pastor. We share the same position and authority in the church. Mm -hmm. Answer. I understand you earlier offered us 10 billion naira so as to move our church out of that place. 
Yes, I did, to enable you move into a bigger and better environment. But your pastor and his stubbornness rejected my offer. And I'm aware that today God is punishing your church for refusing that money. Chief, sir, if that offer is still open, please give me the check. I swear to God, I will move that church out of that place today, today. I want an end to this battle. For God's sake, what's all this obsession with the word battle? Look, I've told you before, there's no battle going on. We all worship the same God in different ways. Okay, here and now, I'm inviting you, Pastor, come and join our family so you can understand us. Yes, come and join us. Me? Yes. <laughs> no, sir. I, I'm an ordained man of God. I can't join an occult group. That's the problem. Who's talking about occult? We do not belong to the occult. Because of our mastery of our environment and our acquisition of powers that govern the universe, there's a tendency on the part of people who don't understand to misconstrue whatever we do. We are not occultists. You read the Bible, don't you? Yes, I do. Our Lord said, and I quote him, these things I do, you too can do, if only you have faith. Do you have faith? You don't have faith, Pastor. You don't. Can you change water into wine? Can you? Can you heal the sick? Can you cast out demons? Can you send thunder to somebody who is an enemy? You can't. But I... I can do all that. Come over. And let us teach you practical faith. You'll be happy. You did. So, you people know the Bible too? The Bible is not exclusive to any one person. Everybody has access to the Bible except you do not want to read it. Wouldn't you like to be able to heal the sick? Restore sight to the blind, make the cripple walk. Wouldn't you like to do all that? Wouldn't you? Me, Pastor Daniel, do all that? <laughs> yes. And you know something? Your church will be on all the television screens of the country. You'll appear in all the magazines. And what is more, your congregation will be much more than a hundred thousand people strong. Mm. So what are you waiting for? Come over and join us. We can teach you how to do all that. But, but Chief. Yes. Um, I am an ordained man of God. Mm -hmm. I spent years with good certificates from four theological schools. Do I look to you like I was ordained by the devil? Do I? I'm a knight of the church. And I'm telling you that God intended that we worship him in different ways. Go and read your Old Testament. Once upon a time, the entire people of the world tried to irritate out of Babylon and get to God midway. It discouraged all of them scattered them in various parts of the world, gave them different languages, just so that they can worship him in different ways. What we do is follow him in our own way. But there's a link between us and you because we worship the same God. And if you come over, shall I teach you how to worship him better? <laughs> A pastor? <laughs> hey! Come, come, Pastor. <laughs>
How are you? Bless you. Yeah, thank you very much. Um, Pastor Christian, I have come to see you once more. Um, don't you think we are wasting our strength and time for nothing? I don't understand what you're saying. Oh, come on, Pastor Christ. <laughs> Can't you read the writing on the wall? Are you blind and deaf? We are losing the members of our congregation in mass. Some of the members of the church are still blind. And just the other day, I heard a woman lost her pregnancy just before your very eyes. I say, Pastor Daniel, mystery and might it seems the strength of the devil. But it withers like snow under the soil when the Lord rises up in battle to protect his people. Uh, do not deceive yourself, Pastor Christ. You see, I have made my decision. And I am no longer a member of this church. Very soon, I will have a church of my own. Good day. Why? Pastor Dan, why? Why? You have a choice. You can come with me if you want to. Has the pastor moved out of the place? No, he has remained stubborn. We have warned him two times, yet he remains adamant. We have never warned anybody more than once, yet we have given him benefit of doubt. It is important that Udemba remains in the fifth realm. Because his inability to, to operate from his house here is a big headache to the family. If something is not done fast, he might lose his powers. We have given him our grace. Yet, he refused it. I want the members of this family to gather at the battlefield. This is an emergency. Hi, hi, hey, hi, 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 Zemaya, 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 oh, oh, Zemaya, 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 oh, Zemaya. Hi, hi. Raise your hands and sing the song of thunder. Now to the main issue, there is an obstacle between us and our destiny, and that obstacle must be permanently removed. I summon thy soul, defiant one. Destiny.
you have dared the seven seas, and so you shall drown in your arrogance. Your blood shall appease Mother Eye, whose temple you have desecrated. I'll lift up my eyes unto the hills, where shall my help come? My help shall come from the Lord that made the heaven and earth. He will not suffer my foot to be moved. He that keeps me will not slumber nor sleep. The Lord is my keeper. The Lord is my shade upon the right hand. The sun shall not smite me by day, nor the moon by night. The Lord shall preserve me from all evil. He shall preserve my soul. The Lord shall preserve my going out and my coming from this fault and even from the moon. Hear me, O Lord. Hear the servant. strength to me before thy enemies. I warn you, Pastor. I warn you like my own son. But you wouldn't listen. And now, you shall die. Lord, Unto the hands I commit my spirit. Semaya, oh 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 Sem